Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com coming at you with a box of 2023 Panini Flawless Baseball. One brief case break number four, pick your team number four, we're chasing the mantle at the end of this break. Very big thanks to this group for making it happen. I think Jason popped open the first half. What did we, what did we see in the first half? Thanks for uh, spending a bit of your Monday night with us. Josh, finishing off the break with that quadruple last spot mojo. 70% of the time, 70% of the last spot mojo teams hit all the time. I think that's how the math works. All right, here we go. There it is, Jason marked that four so we know it's from the same case. Dodgers Giants on the background, scoreless. River Ryan making his big league debut. He's doing all right. He's through four. Noren runs. He's got some good stuff. So you got three hits here. We got one in the middle. Looks like we have a patch auto off to the left. Try not to peek at the hits. And then here we'll do the we'll go from right to left. Because I think the auto's right here. All right, we're going to lead off with Reggie Crawford. 10 out of 10, quad relic going to Dylan and the Giants. Here is three out of five legendary materials, Lefty O'Doul. Legendary materials, old Lefty O'Doul. Lefty O'Doul. And that is the Philadelphia Phillies in 2020, 1929 and 1930. Gilo remembers this guy. What's your favorite Lefty O'Doul story? Give me a good Lefty O'Doul story, Gilo. Uh, Phillies, Thomas with the fighting Phils. And all aboard the Big Hit Express. Woo woo! What if he had, what if Lefty O'Doul actually, actually had just, uh, just a left hand? <gasps> Hello! <laughs> Hi! Hi! How's it going? Oh, you are so excited to be here. You are so excited to be here. <laughs> Michael brought his dog to visit. All right, then we got Michael Bush. Four out of 20. Dual relic and autograph. It's Dodgers edition. That's going to go to Raymond. 
Lefty O'Doul was instrumental in spreading baseball's popularity in Japan, serving as the sport's goodwill ambassador before and after World War II. The Tokyo Giants, sometimes considered Japan's base best baseball team, or Japan's baseball team, like the Cowboys, I guess, America's team, was named by him in 1935 in honor of his longtime association with the New York Giants. The logo and uniform of the Giants of Japan strongly resemble their North American counterparts. He's in the San Francisco Bay Area Sports Hall of Fame in 1981 and in the Japanese Baseball Hall of Fame in 02. O'Doul was inducted into the Baseball Requilary's Shrine of the Eternals in 2013. There you have it. He operated a Hofbrau style restaurant and bar he found in 1958, operated for years after his death as Lefty O'Doul's restaurant and cocktail lounge. Man. There you go. What a life. Here is Jared Schuster, 18 out of 25. Barry in Atlanta. And we got Zach Neto, 8 out of 20. That's Josh and the Angels, one of his last Bob Mojo teams. Here is Rafael Furcal, 19 out of 20. For the Braves, that'll be for Barry and the Braves. Besides the ineligible shoeless Joe Jackson, by the way, O'Doul has the highest career batting average of, a, of any player eligible for the yeah, Hall of Fame who's not enshrined. So that, that's your lefty O'Doul talk, end of the day. Here is Sedan Rafaela. Dual relic and autograph, 12 out of 20. Ryan Heinz. He's having a really solid season this year. We got Colton Kowser. Rookie, patch, and autograph. Four out of 15. Eugene with the Baltimore Orioles. With the O's. O, 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 O'Reilly. Auto parts. And we've got Spencer Jones, 11 out of 25 for the Yanks. That'll be for Taylor and the Yankees. All right, not bad in the slider box. Pretty solid stuff. All right, now let's see what we got for our encased cards. Good luck, everybody. On this side here, we've got 13 out of 20. Zach Neto Diamond, rookie diamond for Josh and the Angels. That's cool. In the middle, oh, and there should be a little cards here somewhere that says these gems are naturally mine, not lab grown. We got three out of 10, lower number here. It is Drew Jones, Matt with the Diamondbacks. Drew Jones Diamond. And your autograph. There's the card that says these gems are naturally mine, not lab grown. Oh, it looks like landscape mode. For Baltimore, Jackson Holiday. Holiday, two out of 15. And that's for Eugene and the Baltimore Orioles. Nice dual relic and autograph. There you have it, boys and girls. The case is closed on pick your team number four. Thanks everybody for watching and for breaking with me. Let's see who's gonna be chasing the mantle. 
So let's flip back to the list. Let's gather everybody's names, one through 30, and everyone in between. New dice, new list. It's one winner, name on top after three. Good luck. One, two, and three. After three times, 29 sad spots. Saddest of all, Gary, who's super close, but just not quite. Um, try to get him next time, Gary, and everybody else. Keep trying, folks. We are running out of entries, though. But after three, can there can be only one winner, and that is Kevin. Kevin M., congrats to you. You are now chasing the mantle. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.